My name is Wendy, and um, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, as far as oh accessories, um, I don't wear a lot of big necklaces or bracelets, and so I think my accessories are my hair. And so I was kind of asking, like, what's the balance between that? All that. <laughs> yes, it was fabulous. And so what, what I was saying, number one, is your hair is an accessory. It's one of the easiest, most fabulous accessories, I think. Um, and then, so I'm looking at her at Wendy, and I'm saying, well, my, my initial take is that she's kind of glamorous. Anyway. I'm wearing my stretch pants. Yeah. I said, yeah, look, that's the power of hair. Right? Did you get that? Because I, this whole time I've been looking at her all day and I was just captured here. And so hair is just that powerful. Um, so her, so anyway, the point is, how do you balance it all? What I want you to think about when you get dressed, and these are all tips today, tomorrow, for the rest of your life. Before you get dressed, ask yourself, we talked about this, um, who is your audience? What do you want to communicate to your audience? Because how you wear your hair and all the layers of your accessories and your clothes and your choices are going to communicate for you. And then what do you want to express in your style? And so what I was sharing with her is, you know, she already has a natural glamour about her. If she, if she wants to feel a little bit more of that, she can put on some sparkle and some bling. But certainly, I wouldn't be having a necklace and then a scarf and then the big cocktail ring. I mean, it's just a bit much. Mm -hmm. But moreover, what we were talking about is, um, what do you really want to communicate? And use your hair and your accessories to do that. Is that helpful? Yeah, thank you. Awesome, thank you. Give her a